What does it take to build a successful restaurant, bar or cafe without having a prime location? As we know, the most important thing in our business is location, location, location. But prime location costs a lot of money and not everyone can afford that. So what does it take? How to create a restaurant in your grandma basement and be successful? Coming up. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the Waitis Academy. We are inside a beautiful Cafe Milano, hidden between the blocks in a small neighborhood in Burgas, Bulgaria. I chose this location, this place, because it is a perfect example how to create a successful business without having a prime location. Let's see how they did it and if it's possible to replicate their success in every town, every country in the world. I had to make an announcement that I'm not getting paid for this video and it's not advertising. I just chose the cafe because I love to come here, drink my coffee, have some snacks, have some cakes and because this is really the way you create a successful joint. As you can see from the video footage, this is a beautiful place. The interior was created by a designer who studied and lived in Milano, Italy. Style and comfort exist seamlessly together and the lightning just adds to the overall pleasant experience. You will find here replicas of the different landmarks around Milano that will remind you of your past trips in the city or educate you for your future trips, future visit in the beautiful city of Milano. And this is the first thing we have to point at when we are talking about the success of a restaurant with no top location, unique interior. It doesn't necessarily have to be a replica of anything. It doesn't necessarily have to be created by a top designer. It just has to be unique has to be comfortable and has to provoke your guests to talk about it. Hey, you know what? I was just in this coffee shop on 5th and uh, Avenue. So cozy, man. It's un unbelievable. You know, it's it, everything is made with style, with finesse. That's what you need your guests to say to their friends. And this is how you do it. You create an interior that makes them feel comfortable provoke their curiosity and they talk about it and this is your best marketing strategy. Unique interior will take you a long way but cannot guarantee the success of your establishment. It takes much more than that. The second factor is the quality of your food and drinks. Here at Cafe Milano, your espresso will be the highest grade, 100% Arabica, and they prepare that amazingly. And that's why I'm every day here to drink my coffee. That's what brings me in this place. Their desserts are no match anywhere in town. And the food, you have a short menu, but everything is delicious and very well and artistically arranged. That's how you convert your guests into a regulars. That's how you provoke them to talk to their friends and promote your establishment. Make no compromises with the quality of your food and drinks. The fastest way to destroy your reputation in your business is to choose a low quality food, low quality drinks, and try to make bigger profit from your guests. This will just bring you down in no time. Another way to have the best free marketing campaign in the world is to create a signature drink or signature meal or dessert that everyone 
falls in love with and talks about it. This is the perfect way to create a buzz around town. You don't have to make money from this dessert, for example. Here in Cafe Milano, they have the best in the world carrot cake. And I'm telling you, it, I don't like even carrot cakes, but I tested this one and I just fell in love with it. If I'm working in this cafe, I will be selling 100 carrot cakes a day because I would tell every single guest that we have the best in the world carrot cake. And that's how you create a buzz. And people come here just for the carrot cake, but they're not going to eat only carrot cake. They're going to drink coffee. They're going to have something else. And once they have this and they love it, they will just keep coming. Every time they want to sit with friends on a coffee, they will bring them here because they will know that they will get a quality drinks and delicious food. So unique interior and amazing delicious food and drinks are the two of the factors that will make your restaurant, cafe, bar successful. Now it's time to talk about the most vital factor in making a successful establishment and that's service. Imagine guys, you have invested all your savings in something really beautiful like this. You have prepared amazing menu and you have selected really top quality products to serve to your guests. And now you have hired a sloppy chef, a grumpy waiter and careless bartender. Everything will go down to hell in no time. You will lose your investment, your dreams, your ideas. Probably go back to your nine to five job to survive. Choose your staff very carefully. Your waiters, your barkeepers are the soul of your restaurant. Interior is amazing, but the atmosphere is everything together. The music, the interior, the service. A good service can make up for a bad meal. Let's say you serve everyday delicious food, but a chef today made a mistake and they serve the food that's not as high quality as usual. A very well-trained, experienced waiter can make up for this mistake. But no delicious food can make up for the terrible service. This is a fact. I don't care how tasty your food is. If you have a grumpy waiter without a smile, with an attitude, bringing the food and serving the drinks to your guests, not making them feel comfortable, not making them feel at home, they will never come back, all right? They might come back to see if this is the same waiter working there, and if that's the case, they just walk away. So choosing your wait staff, your chef, your barkeeper properly is the most vital part of your success. <music>I wish I could tell you that having a great interior, delicious food and drinks and amazing service will make you successful 100%. But that's not the case, guys. Most of the bars and restaurants go broke in the first six months of a year because they are underfunded. You have to be prepared for the first year to support your business financially because for all this to take your guests, convert them to a regular, make them bring their friends here will take time. And you have to have the money to support your business, pay the salaries in order for this thing to grow day after day after day and start supporting you for many years to come. 
And there is one more thing to make your business successful, guys. And this is passion. You have to have the passion for the hospitality industry. Without you being here, present, every single day, from opening to closing hours, leading your team with passion and professionalism, this will not happen. Because even if you hire the best waiters in the world, the best chef in the world, you not being here, not just leading the way, but also controlling everything, will bring the situation down those people will start living because at the beginning there will be not so much business and they will not be making so much money you are the one who keeps this all together you have to sit down talk to the people you gotta go to your guests you have to greet them with a smile with a friendly attitude Make sure you get personal with every single table that come and visit you. Recognize the people that come second time in your establishment. This is very important. That's how you make them feel at home. And that's how you provoke them to talk about it and bring their guests here. And that's how you make business successful. Thank you guys for being here. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to visit the Waiters Academy. Train your waiters with the free online waiter training class. Or if you're a waiter watching this video, make sure that you go through the training, get a certificate, you can pass all the tests. And don't forget, we recently launched the Waiters Network where you can find your waiters or your waiters can find you and get a job. So create your profile. And let's change this industry for the better because right now we are going through a tough, tough times. But better days are coming. No matter how long it takes, we will go through this like everything else and we will survive in the days when there will be a lot of jobs available are coming. We just have to be prepared for them. Thank you guys. Stay safe, stay out of trouble, work hard and make good money. I'll see you soon.